Well, tonight, crews are still working on Jefferson Regional Medical Center in Pine Bluff after a fire damaged parts of its electric system. Thanks for joining us at 5. I'm Faith Woodard. And I'm Roly Hoyt. It's been all hands on deck to keep patient care going and to fix what caused the fire. THV 11's Ian Russell has the latest details on their progress. Things look a lot different out here at Jefferson Regional than they normally would. A fire last night has energy crews scrambling out here to get things fixed and ambulances taking patients to outside of Pine Bluff. Tuesday night was a busy one for Josh Bishop. I've been doing it 12 years. We've never had anything like this that we've in, in the state that I know of. As CEO of Emergency Ambulance Services Inc., he's used to the controlled chaos that comes with the job, but never one like this. There was really no starting the day because it never ended yesterday, but I knew that uh, there was a possibility they would have to evacuate the remaining patients and this morning they confirmed that that possibility came from this a fire at the main campus of Jefferson Regional pictures taken by a THV 11 viewer Tuesday night show burn spot on pieces connected to the electric grid a spokesperson for Entergy confirmed there were actually two separate incidents one Tuesday morning and the fire Tuesday evening but we worked last night to uh, help them get all of their ICU and uh, ED patients transferred out to whatever accepting hospitals they could go to within the state. Bishop says that 13 patients were transferred last night. We've reached out to Jefferson Regional to talk about what happened. They released a statement on Facebook, which says the fire was put out quickly. As of 11 a.m. Wednesday, outpatient surgeries, procedures, and testing for Wednesday and Thursday were canceled. The emergency room is up and running, but those ambulances, like the ones from EZ, are out helping still. This is not going to affect emergency service uh, on a daily basis. Crews from around the state all coming together to make sure what happened here doesn't slow down care. And we had to bring in extra staff and everybody did what they had to do to get the goals accomplished and get the best patient care they could for our patients. In Pine Bluff, Ian Russell, THV 11 News. Ian, thank you. The Entergy spokesperson says that they hope to have restoration work done by 10 o'clock tonight. And the Jefferson County judge has declared an emergency so the hospital can get state aid if needed.